Chattanooga Mayor Andy Burke held a news conference today as Hamilton County reported 34 new COVID-19 cases. Channel 3's Claudia Coco joins us live now with the latest. Claudia. David, Mayor Burke did address the rising number of COVID-19 cases in the Chattanooga area. He says also that city meetings could be moving to in person in just over a week. Mayor Burke started out his press briefing with a story about a young woman who lost her teenage brother and mother to COVID-19. It's a reminder of the tremendous toll that COVID-19 is having on our community and on our country. As of June 25th, Hamilton County reported more than 2,000 cases and 29 deaths. A University of Washington study showed that only 15% of Tennesseans wear masks in public. And Monday, Chattanooga was rated number two on the New York Times list of places that could flare up next. Uh, and that is a, an extremely sobering statistics. You do not want to be at the top of that list. But as cases continue to rise in Hamilton County and across the country, public meetings may continue in person. This is after both the city and the county asked for the governor's order allowing Zoom meetings to extend. And his initial statement, as I understand it, was that he was going to let those orders expire, which means that every one of the boards and commissions would have to meet in person which means city council would have an in-person meeting on July 7th. Mayor Burke says they need to keep council members with underlying health conditions and the public safe. And that means, you know, um, having space between uh, people in the audience, making sure that there aren't large groups, all the things that we're talking about, and that's going to that's going to require space restrictions. And as for if they're going to require masks, Burke says they're looking into it. Uh, and so, um, so we're looking into whether we have the authority to do so. Um, I will tell everybody that, um, that I believe that we should all wear a mask when we're out in public. Burke says they are limited with, the, with what they can do uh, because of the state government. He did say that um, Chattanoogans need to be taking steps to slow the spread, and that includes wearing a mask. For now, live from home, Claudia Coco, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.